going on? What's for dinner? Hunt, someone for you? Me? Hi, Rand. Hiya. We didn't know you were having a party. Well, come on in, girls. Got loads of food and stuff. It's all right. Oh, come on. Come on in. One through the kitchen. Why have you come here? Because we didn't get what we told you. Woo! And you know what will happen if we don't look at your head in. If you don't get us ten quid on Monday, you're dead. Yeah. Don't let us down, eh? It started with a kiss. Anthony, someone to see you. Glass of limo, girls. Yes, please, Mrs Murray. Oh, yes, please, Mrs Murray. More? None for you, Anthony Murray. Not while you told me still off. Don't even think about snitching. Or your life won't be worth it. Oh, oh. oh you shaved like a leaf. Come on, I'll take you home. Oh, uh, it's all right. We'll take him. Yeah, we know where he lives. No, I'll do it. Phone. Oh, OK. Um, you two look after him, won't you? Yeah. yeah. Sure. You dare try it or tell anyone. And we'll have another tenner next week. I'm not giving you that much money again. You better add or else you're dead. Anymore. This is serious. Don't you dare touch me ever again. From now on, you do as you're told and don't even think of trying to stand up to us. Welcome to the seniors. I'll tell you what, I've got a pasty for me dinner. Do you fancy going to Harvey Harvey's? Great. Come on then. Going on. Hi, Aunt. Hi, yeah. But I'm going to be looking out for you just in case she tries it on her own. Yeah. yeah, of course. Thanks. See you later. Bye. It started with a kiss. I'll tell you what I don't like. It's that. Kate Bush. <laughs> Girl power. We can't draw to boy. Where's our ten quid? Forget about ya. We'll get ya. You let my mum and dad think it was boys. And it was them girls. You let girls bully ya. He's let two girls bully him for money since Easter. Two girls and he wouldn't even fight back. 
It's girls bullying him. Why don't you ask him? Are you getting bullied by girls? You want to see them? Like a bit of glocks? They're girls. You can't let yourself be ordered around by girls. 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 Don't let them push you around. You're a lad. You're stronger than them. You're late. It's a back, Anthony. Touch me and I'll kill you. What are you waiting for, Itta? I can't say that. Go on, Itta! Look at her! <laughs> Get to your lessons before I eat you myself. Touch me, mate, and I'll have you for assault. Get to your lessons! I'm sorry, Dad. Sorry, no bloody god, Anthony! Anthony. Any for the guy? Thank you. It's all very much. Listen, son, after what happened, I'm going to need a little bit of help getting this sorted. Yeah, well, then everyone will know that I've been picked on by a pair of girls. You look more like me, Marion, if you ask me. Then you are a fool. Watch out, Robin, it's the sheriff's men. I'm going to do your favourite for tea. Chicken tea, Greg. your problem? What is your problem? You meth. Just bad as him. Still listening to Kate Bush. Gas! Put it back. You didn't see that on Specky. I'm warning you. Go on then, make me. You deserve that. You haven't hit the last of this. I'm Jean Clough. Imelda's mum. She was trying to rob the garage, you know. Imelda's a good kid. <laughs> Get out! Just stop letting people walk all over you. Oh well, from now on I'm not gonna let that page on Imelda push me around anymore. It started with a key. Oh, I don't believe it. It's just a little meth we wanted to wear it with. He's at it. Have you come to apologise for what your sister done to Mel? No. Ooh, standing up for yourself. Dead hard. <laughs> I did. What are you going to do with that? <gasps> OK. It's OK, son. No, it's not OK. You'll never leave me alone now. Anthony. Even you couldn't fight them, and you're me dad. See you in class, Molly. We'll be waiting for you. I'm going to be late for school. Later. Boy. <laughs> oh, please don't! Yes. Please don't! I am 
finish with you, yeah. <laughs> Stomach can handle one of my chilies. But half an hour, right? What's going on? Children, they're animals, they're monsters. Stripping them naked and leaving them lying on the floor. What pleasure could they possibly get from that? I don't know. You saw the state of them. And you saw the state of the toilets afterwards. Those bullies will burn in hell for what they've done to you. When we go to Mass on Sunday, we'll say a prayer for their immortal souls. Not that it'll do them much good. <laughs> it started with a kiss. You are a fool. Come on, Anthony. Get off me! Corn beef ash. So, why are you here? I'm, I'm here to uh, do my best, uh, give 110%. Uh. <sighs> How can it be so so What's going on? London's welcome to her. I hope she rots there. <laughs> Andy, what do you think you're playing at? <laughs> Sounds like someone being murdered. No, he doesn't. He used to be an SAS man on a secret mission to Russia. Yeah, they killed him. Um, how old are you, Susan? I am 47, and that's just one side of me. I dreamed a dream in time gone by. If your name is read out, I'd like you to meet us at the side entrance to Block B at second break. Harriet Ainsworth, Alan Cox, Lindsay Fielding, Alan Cox, Sean Naylor, Alan Cox, Anthony Murray, Alan Cox, Cox, Alan Cox. We have a warrant to search the premises. I thought I'd see the day when a policeman searched through my private things. I've never been so humiliated. They've been through everything up there. I wonder if 
mind if the police officer takes sugar? But you don't know much about what he gets up to, do you? None of us know anything about that Clough girl going missing or about whatever's happened to her. I do. I know what happened. What are you saying, Anthony? It was me. <sighs> I know what he'd like. One of his nins' vegemin special. I said I'm not hungry. Going on. Hi. Well, she chased me from school to the pond, and the next minute, we were in the water. Anthony Murray. I'm arresting you for the murder of Imelda Clough. How do you plead? Guilty or not guilty? Not guilty, sir. Don't think you believe in that, will you, son, eh? No, please don't go. You can act like a man now. I'd like to call Anthony to give his evidence. She did some terrible things to you by all accounts. Forcing you to walk home with no trousers. No, we only hit her once. You hit her, threw her into the pond and drowned her. They were bullying me. Why did you do it? They were bullying me. Why? They were bullying me. And you than they're always being in. Hit me. Court is adjourned. If she keeps looking at me like that, I'll clock her one. Will the defendant please stand? On the charge of murder, do you find the defendant guilty or not guilty? Not guilty. Anthony, <laughs> you're free to go. Dancing on the chippy? Anthony? Stay! Anthony, what are you doing? Anthony, come on, open the door! What's the worst thing you've ever done? Stole Lippy from this big flash shop in town. I'm pure evil, aren't I? Do you like it? It started with a kiss. You said you'd see a new Anthony. <laughs> yes. What's the food like? It's okay. I had uh, cornflakes. What the? You little cow. Just eat some more chips first. Go and get your Easter egg. What's an ice cream for your afters? I'm a boy, yeah. Then you are a fool. Oh my God.